Good morning, happy Friday. It's 11.48 in the p.m. It's a beautiful day. Um, 76 degrees and uh, a little hazy, but bright and sunny nonetheless. I'm gonna go get that one class done and uh, I'll talk to you in a little bit. Okay, check it out. Here is the Puffer Belly, downtown Kent with the Z3. Um, I've eaten here several times. It's, it's actually very good. And I'm just, I'm, I'm really early for class, so I'm kind of exploring the area here. And they are doing a crap ton of work here in Kent. Um, building kind of like a first and main thing, like we have downtown Hudson. They're building a big area. It's called uh, Acorn Valley or something like that. So that's cool. And I don't know if I can make a left here or not, but I'm going to explore for a few minutes. Here's one of the new big buildings they've built. There's uh, a lot more on the other side. Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to learn my way around this area. It's pretty nice. All right, so a few minutes ago, uh, I was waiting to make a left on one of these streets, and where I was turning, there's a Jeep Wrangler police car, right-hand drive, never seen it before. The guy's wearing what looks like something Alex Roy would have worn as a police thing, but it did say Kent City Police on it or whatever and the woman that he's sitting behind trying to make a right, which is where I was coming from, wasn't moving up into the, into the intersection to make her turn. So he's the cop is yelling out the window, move up into the intersection, like three times. She doesn't hear him. I can tell the thing was a manual because he rolled back a few feet before he pulled the e-brake or whatever. And he got out of the car in the middle of the intersection, walks up to this woman and starts yelling at her. And I think once he saw that she was definitely on the old side, he kind of backed off a little bit. But that's funny, I've never seen a cop get out of his car in the middle of the intersection to go tell somebody how to drive. But uh, I think we need more of that. People around here can't drive. Welcome to Ohio. So we get to park next to this today. E46 328 with a five speed, looks like. Yep, five speed. Tons of stuff in the back. Very dirty wheels. But uh, at, least it's, at least it's nice, I guess. 3.40, home from school, it was pretty awesome. Friday, good class today. And uh, on the way home, it started pouring rain for five minutes, so I just spent the last 40 minutes re-cleaning everything I did with the car yesterday. Now I have to go mail something to Green Bay, so we'll take the Accord. Pretty much typical though, today was a 10% chance of rain and it poured and hailed for five or 10 minutes. And now there's a huge storm system over half of Ohio. How do they not see this coming? I, I really don't understand how it is the year 2012 and our technology is so bad that we can't see a storm. Uh, literally the size of, uh, let me think of a state that size, the size of Florida coming over Ohio. I don't get it, I really don't. Cool car for the post office, it's a manual too. Good morning, 106. I got back from Kenan's house, so I went over there and left the camera on my desk. Anyways, we just ate some ice cream bars and played with iPads. Uh, anyways, watch later playlists at 8, emails at 2. That seems very doable for tonight. Tomorrow, Saturday, it's going to rain all day, so I'm having the grandfather pick me up at 9 in the smart car, so that'll be, be fun. Take me back to uh, how that used to be every day. Uh, it's actually kind of raining outside right now, but uh, the M's clean, so that's good. And I can't really think of anything else to say. It was a decent Friday, had its ups and downs, and uh, tomorrow's Saturday, so hopefully we'll enjoy the weekend. Weather picks up again on Monday. Um, uh, three emails. Let's see what this one is. It is uh, on how to drive a manual transmission. Can you stop at a stop sign? Uh, break? Yeah, I'll have to answer that. All right, that's it. I'm not going to waste your time. Talk to you tomorrow, Saturday. Hope you had a good week. Enjoy your weekend. Good night.